Hi, and welcome to the Department of Material Science and Engineering. My friends and I would like to show you around and give you an idea of what it's like to study materials at the University of Sheffield. One of the best things about studying here is that we get a lot of lab time, and that means that if you enjoy a hands-on experience, this could be the perfect course for you. Let's take a look. Hi, Nathan. Here we are in the Diamond, a building dedicated to teaching engineering students. Let's have a look around. In the materials lab, we test different materials to understand their properties and why they behave the way they do. We look at how atoms arrange themselves within the material and how this affects their properties. We get training in equipment usually found in research and industrial labs like mechanical testing rigs, microscopes, x-ray equipment and thermal analysis kit. Also in the diamond, we have lectures and there are plenty of places to study and spend time with your friends. There's also a library, group study spaces, student support services, a recording and editing suite, and there's even a TV studio. So that's the diamond, and down the hill is the materials department. That's where the lecturers live. We also have lectures and lab sessions there. Let's go for a walk. Welcome to the Hadfield building. I'll introduce you to some of my course mates. Hi, I'm Dennis and I'm a material scientist in my third year. I'm currently doing a research project within the STAR research group at the University of Sheffield. We're researching titanium powder alloy and the sintering of samples. I think the lectures are a great complement to the practical work that we do within our curriculum. Uh, and I also really like that the lectures are, are quite approachable and being a small department, we always have access to them and we often do several projects with them as well. I love that as students we're given access to this industry level machinery, uh, which I think will give us an edge when looking for an apprenticeship or a job. Excellent. Let's head upstairs. Welcome to the Magnetics Lab. This is where the Functional Magnetic Materials Research Group carry out a lot of their experiments. So this is the Magnetic Lab's FMERC, which stands for Focused Magneto Optical Kerr Effect. And it uses tiny changes in the polarisation of laser light in order to investigate the magnetic properties of a material. So last year I was the president of MATSOC, the Materials Society, a society for students, by students. And we organise loads of events every single year, including bar crawls and other social events. We have our annual Spring Ball and Christmas Cayley, as well as loads of sports teams if that's what you're interested in. And these are all things that you can take part in as a member of our department. I'll introduce you to my friend James. Hi James. Hi, oh, yeah. My name's James and I'm working on a new material for electrolytes in, for solid oxide fuel cells. I'm using a variety of pieces of equipment in order to manufacture my samples which are then tested in an impedance spectroscope. This material will be used in hydrogen fuel cells for use in automotive and other applications. So in second year uh, we all took part in the Artifacts project uh, this involved a small group of you taking part uh, an everyday household object. Uh, this year it was a toaster. It was a really good experience. Um, we were able to plan our own projects, decide what we needed to test and how, and presented our findings uh, to both academics and industry. Hi, on E-Floor we have lecture theatres and the Turner Museum of Glass. We use it as a social space as well as somewhere to study in between lectures. You'll often bump into staff in here, which means that you can talk to them about the things that you've learned. Because of the reputation of the department, we attract world leading researchers, which means that the people you're taught by will truly be experts in their field. Here we are on F floor. Let's say hello to the people in the student support office. You can come in here to ask almost anything about your course. If they don't know the answers, they'll know someone who does. 
There's also the Student Support Information Desk in the Students Union who are able to help you with anything from banking to visas, accommodation to health and wellbeing. So that's a bit about the learning we do and the support that's on offer. But what's it like to be a student here? In the Department of Materials Science and Engineering, you'll work with people from all over the world. We have staff and students from over 40 different countries. This is a great opportunity to learn about other cultures and make contacts overseas if you ever go and visit or even work in other countries. I'm Ho Wen and I'm from China. I chose to study materials at Sheffield because Sheffield is a world-class university. Its materials department is the second in the UK and has academics across all aspects of materials. The staffs and academics are very friendly, approachable and supportive and we also have many hands-on practical skills which will greatly enhance our abilities and also help us in future career. Sheffield is also a really welcoming place for international students. It has students from everywhere which shapes this university and the city. Our MN students do extended work placement or research projects between years three and four. Some decide to do it in Sheffield, some decide to do it nearer to their hometown, and others decide to do it in more exotic places. For example, one girl decided to go to Monterey in Mexico. Unfortunately, we couldn't wangle a trip to Mexico, but we can take you to some students who decided to stay here locally. Yeah, the industrial placement for me was a, definitely an integral part of uh, my course. Uh, as it counted towards the course itself, uh, it counts for credits, uh, so it's assessed to the report and the presentation. Um, so it's definitely a very important uh, placement to get for me. The University of Sheffield is probably, I think, is the only university within the UK that offers it as part of its degree. And um, it's, it's really eye-opening. It shows you what industry is actually like compared to just learning about the theory um, at university and lectures. To see it in reality, in action, is a completely different ball game. So the skills that I've taken from my course that I can apply to my workplace is the skills that I learned in the ITP project, which is the industrial training program. Uh, so in the ITP project, we learn about time management, producing gun charts, uh, writing our reports, giving presentations, group discussions and stuff like that. And I felt because of all these skills, I've been more comfortable in giving presentation to my colleagues, uh, writing out technical reports for the company and stuff like that. So that's just a little bit about studying material science and engineering here at the University of Sheffield. But there's so much that we couldn't cover it in just one video. With over 300 societies, dozens of sports teams, there's something for everybody. And if you can't find it, you can always create it at the Union. I really hope you're going to come and study material science here at University of Sheffield. Bye-bye for now. <laughs>